Good morning, Peninsula High School. My name is Brianna Kirkhart. Our top stories today, choir at state, coin wars, all this, and so much more coming up on Peninsula News. Big congratulations to our band and choir students for their fantastic performance at state competition. Peninsula had the best showing in participation and scores in well over 10 years. Special shout out to our Bass Quartet, Henry Glor, Luca Hawkins, and James Kane for receiving the majority, if not all, super ratings from their panel of judges. The biggest news of all is that our own Dylan Shipman placed third in state for Bass Quartet solo. We have not had a student place in this competition for Peninsula over 15 years. Wow, way to go Dylan. Band and choir students crushed this weekend and we are so PHS proud of all of you. The class of 2027 fundraiser of Coin Wars has finally been concluded. The points have been totaled up and we appreciate all donations. Here are our top three classes. Coming in third place, we have Mr. Cobb's class. Up in second place, we have Mr. Bruce's class. And now please drum roll for the winning class, Mr. Pratt's class. Please give them a huge congratulations and we will get all the donations as your prizes. The, fun, the freshmen are very grateful and we thank you all again for competing for our donations. Freaky Friday is starting up next week. Please purchase your tickets at purplepass.com. We hope to see you there. We will send it off now to Lila in the field with your upcoming weather for this week. Hi, I'm Lila Klinger with this week's weather. Today has partial clouds with a high of 61 and a low of 43. Tuesday will have partial sun breaks with a high of 65 and a low of 43. Friday has scattered showers with a high of 60 and a low of 49. Saturday will bring more showers with a high of 60 and a low of 47. Sunday will also have scattered showers with a high of 60 and a low of 47. That's it for this week's weather. Back to you, Brianna. Thank you, Lila. And now with this week's sports, here is PC and Olivia. Thank you, Brianna. This week in PHS Sports. Boys baseball took a couple of tough losses over the weekend against Timberline, but are looking for a big win tonight against crosstown rival Gig Harbor. The Hawks are 11-7 overall, 8-5 in league play. Game time is today at 4 p.m. Come out and get one of the last chances to see our team in action in regular season play before the playoffs. Lacrosse lost against Gig Harbor, losing the coveted Bagataway. Lacrosse's next game is this Friday against Auburn Riverside at 7.30 here at PHS. Boys soccer have made the playoffs with a 5-8-1 record. We wish them all the best in postseason play. And that covers it for this week's sports report. I'm PC. And now back to you, B. Thank you, PC. That wraps it up for this week's broadcast. My name is Brianna Kirkhart. I've been joined by PC, Olivia Ava, and Lila. Behind the scenes, thanks to our broadcast director, Andrew Krevenko, Gwen Bean, Mr. Mix, student leaders, and school administration. And a big thanks to all of you for watching. We'll see you here next week on Peninsula News.